Take a look out the window Spirit goes up as the rain falls down I've been sitting on the wrong course Hello friends, welcome or welcome back to my channel My name is Mackenzie if you're new here And today we're in Costa Rica Like we're in Costa Rica right now There's a bug um, We're like in the jungle right now I'll show you in the morning But anyways Um I'm gonna show you everything in the morning. I just wanted to let you guys know we're here. We're about to eat leftovers from our lunch earlier and we're staying in this little cabin. This is the vibe and like, if we're quiet, you can hear the crickets, like. It's so cool. Anyways, I will see you in the morning when we go do like all the hikes and stuff we're doing. Good morning, friends. It is day two in Costa Rica. I don't know what's off with my camera lighting right now. Maybe it's just dark in here, but. I want to give you a little tour of where we are. Can't put it together like I did before. Think that I said this a few times. Even with that, has it ever felt right? I swear that this has happened every moment. Can I just be honest? I was only one. Hi, friends. Okay, we are about to leave. We are going to the La Fortuna waterfall. It's like a 20 minute hike, and it's like mostly stairs, so. I think it'll be pretty easy and then we're gonna come back pack our stuff and go to the next place but i will see you at the waterfall we're here oh my god we just finished the hike it was not that hard it was just a lot of stairs and so like super heavy on cardio and julia and i were both like wow that humbled us like so much i have so many pictures to share i'll show you one right now um, but we just were heading back to like Airbnb to go pack up and leave but we stopped for coffee because I need coffee But this is like the vibe of where we walked to um, It was so pretty We got some coffee. I showed you the cute little coffee shop. It's called Nomada It's like right outside of the La Fortuna waterfall um, like it's on the drive down and got an iced vanilla latte with Lactose free milk, which I've never had before, but I didn't want almond milk in my coffee, so we're gonna see how it works mm -hmm. on my stomach. Anyways, we're gonna go back, pack up our stuff, and leave so that we don't hit like darkness driving. Yeah, we wanna get there in daylight so that we can do something too. True. We just stopped at this lunch place called Cafe and Macadamia, and it's in Lago Arena, Costa Rica. You guys, this view, just wait. This is crazy. This is where we're eating. Our food just got here and it looks so bomb. Like, wow. We got a vegetarian pas pasado? Yeah. I think. Pasado. And we got giant smoothies. Yeah, I taste my orange juice. Mm. So we just got to the Airbnb. That drive honestly wasn't that bad, but you guys, first of all, the Airbnb has a puppy because it's like the, the people live here and then it's like a separate house. Come here, Peepa. Come here. They said she thinks she's like four and they think she's like four and a half, five months. And she's adorable. And it makes me miss scooter baby boy. You like my camera? And you can't eat that. Anyways, let me give you a quick tour because it's freaking beautiful. Okay, this is outside, but then you walk into like our little private villa type vibe. And it is insane. There's a mini fridge here. The little bathroom area. Look at this view. People loves us. <laughs> There's the bed, the balcony, and then the toilet is on one side and the shower is on the other side, which it's so cute here. I'm genuinely obsessed with this view and with this doggy. Hi, Peepa. Hi. I think they said they rescued her too, right? Yeah. Hi, Peepa. I just swam for a little bit, but I'm going to shower. Literally the walk from the pool. <laughs> it's like two steps. Okay, I'll see you when we're ready for dinner. Okay, we showered and got ready for dinner, and now we're gonna go to dinner, so. See you all. You guys, we're fully driving to dinner right now, and Julia goes, there's monkeys! Look up. Oh my, oh my god. They're so cute, I love them. Oh my god, there's so many. I'm actually obsessed with these little boys. They're so handsome. <gasps> there's a baby! <gasps> a baby monkey! Shut up! Is there really? Yes. He's right there. He's following his mommy. Wow, you guys are so cute. I hope you know that. 
They're just crawling. <gasps> that one has a baby on its back. Look, 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 Julia, look how little it is. We all know my motto is that we never, ever, ever skip dessert. So, um, this is what I got, or what we got, we're sharing it. Um, it's a banana bread ice cream cake. So it's like banana bread on both sides, ice cream, and then chocolate and caramel. Mwah. All right, we're gonna go destroy this. <laughs> This is so messy. Hi guys. Mm. Except it might drip on me, but it's fine. Mm. You honestly could. Good morning, guys. We woke up for sunrise this morning. It's like 5:50 right now, and it is gorgeous out. It's literally 6 a.m., and there's so many surfers out there. It's crazy. Okay, update guys, that coffee that I showed you a little bit ago, it was absolute trash. So we threw it out and now we're at another coffee shop and I'm gonna find this one better. It looks more promising. It's called Taf Cafe Tico, it looks really good. We just got our breakfast, it looks so bomb. Guys, papaya is my favorite fruit and this bowl is loaded with it. Hi my friends, I don't remember when the last time I talked to you was, but we are at the beach now. I took a dunk in the ocean. It felt so good. I feel like I'm like on top of the world every time I swim. Um, and yeah, we're at, I don't know what the beach is called, but I'll write it on the screen when I remember. It is absolutely so beautiful. It's like pretty secluded. There's a good amount of people and there's like a little smoothie stand out front. So I'm definitely gonna get one of those, but I'm really just ready to toast because the UV right now, I don't know, but it's really high. I'm gonna go swim with my GoPro in a little bit. Maybe I'll add some of that footage in here. Um, but yeah, it's gorgeous. Maybe we could take it to a different conversation. Things will get uncomfortable, but only if we make it. I just want to say that. But you... I don't know how clear the water looks in my video. There's horsies on the beach. They're so cutie. And we just got smoothies. I got papaya, mango, and banana, I think. And a little coconut water, but I already finished it. So now I'm just eating the coconut out of the inside. Hi guys, we have, I haven't vlogged in a few hours. We've been at the beach and then we went to another beach, um, but now we're getting food. We got some water. I don't look toasted, but you guys, I am very sunburned. So I need to literally chug this water. <sighs> Yay. We are back, I'm all showered. I feel so much better. I need to get work stuff done, but that's the next thing I'm gonna do. For now, the sun is setting over the Airbnb and it looks so pretty. That is insane, you guys. It's so pretty up here. <laughs> it's actually crazy. We came for the week. All right, we're about to grub, so I'll see you in a little bit. was crying at her door. Oh Hi, sweet girl, where are you? Oh, you're sweet. No. Okay, okay. She knew where to go. <laughs> she loves us. Hi, baby Pippa. You want the money because that's Lola's bunny. Yeah, both of our dogs are gonna be so mad at us. Lola's bunny. <laughs> they're gonna be so sad when we leave tomorrow. Oh, Pippa. We have to come back to see you when you're grown up. Yeah, you're gonna be so big. Miss Girl's having the time of her life in her room. <laughs> no swimsuits for you. Pippa. Pippa, Pippa, Pippa. We made a quick pit stop before the farmer's market to get breakfast. At this place, we actually got dinner from our lunch from yesterday, and it is so good. What is this to not play, not play. Okay, we just got to our second Airbnb and this might be the most stunning Airbnb I've ever seen in my life I'm obviously gonna link all the Airbnbs down below but like Especially if you want to stay near the beach. It's walking distance So we came first because the farmers market and beach are walking distance 
so good so it's like shared like these are all little private ones right there i think there's one over there but it's like once you walk in this door everything is yours and so the door shuts and we have our own little private pool little outdoor kitchen area two little seated areas outdoor shower this wall is absolutely stunning you are going to see this all over my instagram because i'm absolutely obsessed with how beautiful it is and then you walk into the door so the bed is air conditioned and it's a little like studio type apartment but also it has a bathroom here is the bathroom so pretty you guys the shower none of the showers here have doors though is one thing i've noticed and then there's the outdoor shower take it all back although you are sunlight you stay in the shade i'm dancing in the corner just to get in the space because i want to believe that Ooh, i get lost you go with your day slowly get closer but you we just got to the beach. I already jumped in the ocean because I was hot. So first thing I did when we got here, but it's called Playa Langusta, right? Yeah. Playa Langusta. This is probably the most beautiful beach we've been to, in my personal opinion. It gives like tide pool, like mermaid vibes, and I love it. And like a lot of the beaches here are super rough, and that like it's really shallow. But I just went and dunked in, and over there looks a little deeper, but still shallow. So I'm gonna go there in a few. But it is just gorgeous. And this is actually only like five minutes away from like the main Tamarindo Beach, um, which is like super touristy and populated. So we're like, let's go to another one. And this one is the perfect spot. Okay, I need to go snorkeling because I feel like there's going to be so many shells based on how many I've already found. In a way, I know it's just a recap, but I'm sure you'll never see that. Rather take it all back. Maybe it's time to get home. Think that it's going a little too far. Even this is about to kill my stomach, but I'm so excited to eat it. We got some calamari. Very good. Get out of the I got some shrimp taco. So good. Hola, we are ready for sunset we just got ready so fast you don't even know the fashion debacle we had with yeah, our outfits but we got ready twice yeah we didn't actually get ready fast at all but anyways we're gonna go run and catch the sunset and take a few quick pictures guys the beach is gorgeous right now oh my god wow sunset was actually so stunning tonight and worth all of our troubles and getting made fun of at the beach by random people but i don't even care because well, you can't see the camera ones because obviously they're on the camera. Then like these on my phone, you can just like see that they're gorgeous. Food is here. Good morning, guys. It is currently 5.30 in the morning and we're going to sunrise. Do we need to? I might go swimming. Um, anyways, it's 5.30. We're going to sunrise. So let's go see how pretty she is. Hello friends, sunrise was gorgeous, um, we hung out for a little bit and now we're gonna go change and head to a yoga class and then we're gonna get coffee and eat and bake and yeah you know the vibe. I'm wearing the cutest little set to yoga this morning, it's from Monty, it's in the print wave I believe. Um, and it's these little micro shorts and then like bralette style top. So cute. I'll link it in my leg to now. Oh my god, I'm covered in sand. Yeah, look at my face. Well, we just finished yoga. It was so good. And there was a guy selling coconut water, so. Mm. I have always been a beverage girly. I've already had a coconut water right after yoga. It's about 30 minutes later and I have a coffee and a smoothie. Mm. Also got some avocado toast. Yumsy. Mm. Okay, you're a little sideways right now because I'm like hanging on the mirror, but we are back. We just shot a little bit of content for Kulani. 
because we had so much and we were like, that'd be cute if we made a few videos. So we did that. It's like almost 11 o'clock and we are about to go head out to the beach. It's our last full beach day here, which is super sad, but it just means I have to come back sooner rather than later because I love it here. Although next time I probably go to more like Manuel Antonio area. We're in Tamarindo, but I've heard Manuel Antonio is a lot more like not touristy. Like there's a lot more wildlife and like the touristy is fun, but we're not people that like go out at night. And I feel like that's what's big here. Like yesterday we were on the beach at sunset and this dude walked up to us and he's like, you're invited to this party later. And we're like, okay, like, well, we won't be there, but thanks. But like, even last night, like it was so packed and crowded driving to get dinner. And then like this morning we went to sunrise and it was so empty. So it's just like crazy difference. But yeah, I do love it here, but I definitely would pick another beach area to stay in next time. Like even where we stayed the first two nights in Tamarindo, it's like 30 minutes north and so it was a lot more secluded but this is convenient because of how close it is to the beach anyways i've been super good at wearing sunscreen this trip because the uvs are wild here like they're actually so high it's crazy okay we are at the same beach we came to yesterday and it's so pretty again so we've been here for literally 20 minutes and i already got another coconut but it was needed it's so hot Anyways, it's absolutely stunning. We brought our leftover pizza from di dinner last night to the beach today so that we wouldn't be starving. Um, I don't really know how much I want to eat pizza right now, but I don't want to go leave that food, so. Pizza it is. Mm. I just posted about this on Instagram, but there was once a time in my life where I would not eat. If I was going to the beach, like I would not eat the whole day. I didn't want to get bloated, but it literally doesn't matter like no one cares and if they care they're projecting their own insecurities onto you and your body is beautiful just as it is all i wanted to say was you're beautiful just as you are feel your body and um, human bodies are it's normal to bloat so literally who cares go eat your food mm. the water is literally so clear i'm obsessed Can we ever have another moment? Can you just be honest? I was only wondering if maybe we can take it to a different color. I just literally rolled around in the sand for pictures, so make sure you're following my Instagram to see those. Um at Kenzie.summers, linking it right there. But we are having a great old day at the beach. I literally love the sunshine so much. Hi friends, we are back from the beach. It was really hot and we both got a little toasty, even though I literally put sunscreen on and three times today. I found an FPF 50, but it was just like, it literally said felt like 99. Like it was so hot. Um, So we came back a little early. I'm gonna make a few videos. I'm munching on some popcorners and then we're gonna get ready for sunset and go to dinner. Yeah, I just got ready for sunset. I was wearing this yesterday and then changed, but this little dress is from Beginning Boutique. The back is stunning. And she's definitely linked on my like to know. Things are getting comfortable, but only if we make it. I just wanna say that. Still, you'd rather take it all back. back at the airbnb dinner was delicious i got like a watermelon and mushroom poke bowl which is like all the other ingredients in poke just not the fish because i don't really like uncooked fish but anyways we are going to be done for the night and go to bed because we're waking up at 4 a.m to drive to a little like waterfall cloud hike in the morning and i don't want to be dead driving so i'm gonna go on my phone edit do whatever i need to do and and go to bed hello guys we are on a hike right now um we're going to like the cloud forest thing i guess we're technically in the cloud forest right now but it's like a two-hour hike and when we were buying the tickets it showed a lot of big animals so yeah like panthers and like tight like a lion was that a lion oh Puma and Jaguar. Just kidding. Don't listen to what I said, but... But nonetheless, we're here and we're going at it. 
You guys, we are literally in the clouds right now. This is insane. We're so high up. Okay, we're on the way back down from the hike and we have yet to see a sloth. We're looking literally everywhere, but we've been hiking for almost two hours, so kind of sad. Like, I'm assuming they'd be up there, but we didn't have binoculars, so it's really hard to see. <laughs> Well, we're done. We just got to San Jose and we were gonna go to the breakfast place or like lunch place we went to the first day and we got here and it's closed but there was a burrito place right by it so we just got burrito bowls and we are very happy to be eating real food. We just got to the Airbnb. I'm in a bikini right now because I had this under my clothes and I just, I don't know, it was sweaty. But anyways, not the point. The point is, the sunset is gorgeous and I need to show you guys. I'll give you an Airbnb tour probably in the morning. But like, look at how pretty that is. Wow, you're good. We're on like the 23rd floor and we're in San Jose. So like the mountains and the city, so pretty. Okay, apparently I abruptly forgot to end this video off, but it is me a few days later. I'm home, I'm editing, and I just wanted to say thank you guys so, so much for coming along. I'm going to link all the Airbnbs we stayed in below, even the last one that I forgot to give you a tour of, but just know it was really pretty. It was super nice. There was a gym, blah, blah, blah. So good. Anyways, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe, do all the things, and I'll see you in the next video. Bye!